back. Um, so today I'm going to do a makeup tutorial for Alice Cooper inspired makeup. I even um, sketched a picture for my inspo. That's kind of what the makeup's going to look like. Um, also too, something came in the mail that I ordered for my, I guess my birthday present. From the cream shop. Um, let's take a look. Yeah, and I was sick for a few days, so I wanted to do this tutorial sooner. But I just was feeling sick and I had to recover, so I'm finally feeling better well enough to do this video and then this came here today so I was like I'm so excited these headbands I don't know if you remember when I got this one oh, I love this one so much the girl B1 I wanted to order more like it and then I was on the internet um, searching and stuff, and they're kind of hard to find, so, like, the last good ones are on the website, so I just wanted to buy them, because maybe they'll never come back in stock, but, um, so this first one here, it's like this mermaid, um, limited edition, um, bandana, and this is Feel Me, it's really, these ones are so soft, that's why I got this. And then the second one, let's see. This one here is chocolate. And it's like purple. Yeah, I'll try these on in a little bit just to show you how cute they look. And then um, my Melody. I love her. Like almost next to Hello Kitty. She, I don't know. I love the Sanrio universe. And that's like another headband like inside. Mm -hmm. It's my first time ordering from this company, so it was pretty fast. It was a little expensive because being in Canada. This one here. Yeah, I'll show these. I'll do a little thing later. My headband. <clears throat> Sorry. I'm still a little sick, but I need a drink. I would have this cool thing at the, the marijuana shop. It's like, um, it's called Ripple, and it's like, um, these little, like, pouches, like a stevia pouch or whatever. It's like this, there's 10 milligrams in it, and you can put them in your drinks and beverages, so um, today I'm going to make, like, a little potion. I'm going to put, like, this THC, like, in my full throttle. Yeah, I, I, some days I, I usually do Monster Energy Drink or Rockstar, but I put, like, a full throttle. I'm gonna mix that. I've never used it before, so I don't know if I have to dissolve, like stir it, or I'm just gonna like. Gosh, I'm gonna um, drug myself. <laughs> okay, and then it's just like sitting on the top. I don't know, maybe I just let it sit for a second to dissolve and I don't know if I had like a little straw I could stir it, but I'm just gonna let it dissolve in the water. His makeup changes a lot. I'm just gonna get right into it. Like it, that was my composition of like um a composition, sorry, of all the uh looks he's given us over the years and recently too. He's still pretty active, Alice Cooper. And his like his real name's Vincent, so I guess and he really talks about himself like as Alice as a character, not like him, even though he legally took the name, apparently. Um, so let's show some of my picture in inspiration. Um, also, too, you might find a Christina Aguilera picture in here, also Britney Spears, just because I was um, trying to get inspo for my look, because I'm going to do the karaoke later, right? Um, so his belt, he always has like double skull belts, and he's got like this cane. 
and then that's kind of sometimes he has skeletons like and that's him in his early years like you can barely recognize him he was so um small framed there's like oh that's his he did a halloween thing special i still yet to watch it but it looks really good oh um so yeah he's so like petite and that's him like in his younger years and yeah that's him on stage with his like gloves and cane and his like stripes oh there's christina <laughs> i just kind of had that like um ringleader or ringmaster look and then i found a picture of him and uh marilyn manson together and i noticed marilyn manson also does like makeup too like um for his like because maybe he's getting like a double chin he used like this black um makeup to give himself like a chin and there's oh yeah britney spears so i was kind of thinking like circus ringleader and um yeah, that's one of his looks, like big, like the sketch I did, big eyes. And then he's got like the spider, so it kind of does look like a spider eye, like. And that's when he's like uh, younger. See how it's spaced out and kind of like feathery, his makeup there. And then he's got like this long bodysuit, like gems, kind of like Britney Spears, that's what I was thinking, like the yeah, dress up. Oh yeah, and her, that's her ringmaster, ringleader look. And then him and uh, Nina, his guitarist, yeah, she's cute. Um, so that's more of his makeup kind of like inspired in my sketch. There. And there's his ring look, kind of. Ring layer. And then him putting makeup on. And then he's just like, that's some makeup he did one night. Like so skinny, his uh, slits. And then I found this picture. Who does that remind you of? I don't know. <laughs> I just was looking and found it. And then some weird picture I also found with like some tube. Yeah, he's very theatrical on stage. And then that's Million Dollar Baby. And then I, it's kind of reminds me of Easter a bit. Because of the ears, the rabbit ears. And then every member has like a pet rabbit and there's like this baby with a bunch of money. That was like a album. And then he would go on like Muppets. He was like really close to the creator, the Jim Henderson or hair, whatever, Jim, the guy that did the Dark Crystal. And then, oh yeah, here's another Marilyn Manson picture. It's like the etching to give him the illusion. So he's really good at being like um, for illusions. I'm getting messages here, hang on. Okay, so, oh yeah, there's Daddy, Daddy Rock. There. Let's keep it going. Oh. Um. So there's, um. And I found this picture. He's like, it's like a knife on his eye. He's looking through it. Switchblade. And there, and then he did an episode of um, Disney show. Disney. Um, this weird. Yeah, it'll come up later. But that's basically his character. He played the voice. And his name is um Alistair Coop Deville. And then there's his like. Um, kind of top hat. He lost a snake, but in the Disney they gave him his snake because I guess that's what he's kind of known for is his snake. And then like dressed up. I didn't. I I saved the video, but I didn't actually watch the full episode. I just found the clip. I'll probably show it. Maybe I'll show a clip of um, the Alistair Coop Deville. <laughs> um, oh yeah, Brittany. Oh yeah, I found this Vincent Price picture with Alice. He's like leading him on because I did a lot of stage performance and stuff. Um, he's like on this collar and chain and then Vincent Price is like leading him and they both have the name Vincent so I thought that was fun and then another Muppets like with the gym um, 
there in Alistair Coop. I found it uh, Alistair Coop to bed. And then Brittany, another Britney picture. I don't know. I just love that bitch. And he kind of has a snake. When he has a snake, sometimes, like, Britney Spears had a snake, too. And they get on stage. And a doll. I noticed all these hard rockers. Um, medals. They like to have the dolls on the stage. And then here's he. He's all, like, his onesies all, like, snipped up. And then he's with all these, like, puppets. <laughs> And then, okay, there's kind of more of his ringleader look. Leopard pants. And top hat. So his makeup's like... Um, yeah, more Britney. I like the thing she said. I want to get something like that to stand on and perform for my karaoke, but is this too elaborate? Um, and then he had his own mascara one time. It was like called Whiplash. And you could like subscribe, like cut it in and say... Oh, it was funny. Like, dear Alice, r rush me how many bottles of whiplash mascara I have enclosed for two. So it was like, he really is selling this uh, lip chat or um, mascara, and it says, liberate your eyes with Alice's own unisex mascara. So it's funny how like this kind of is all like back. That's what he was kind of known for was like pushing the envelope or whatever, and. His eye makeup is like d really dark, and then he has more doll. I just found another doll picture. This one looks like like a mannequin, and I think he even kissed the doll on stage. <laughs> um, there's his mascara. Look at his outfit. That's like what people would be wearing today. He's such an early trendsetter, Alice Cooper. And then this um, album came out. I like this one too. Apparently, this is when he was like. After Born Again Christian, he came out with this album. And then, that's kind of uh, more makeup to get inspired by. Yeah, his whip, he, li he likes a whip a lot. Or like, um, there he is. Some more, like, ringleader in there. It's his girl. And then this one was, like, Paranormal with the two heads. That was an okay album. I listened to a bit of it. It's all right. And, yeah, that's basically... <laughs> my ideas and insta that I'm going to be pulling from. All right, let's check if this is dissolved. It's really dissolved. You wouldn't even been able to tell that someone put 10 milligrams in this. <laughs> it's like tasteless because this is citrus and I think the flavor I got was like, um, it was citrus too. Oh, this is amazing. <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna start. First things off, it's a pretty easy look because he doesn't use any white, I noticed, because he's so pale himself. Like, he just kind of keeps his natural tone, but it's all in like the eye makeup. And plus, too, he's a performer, so it goes with eye makeup and his outfit. So I did get myself cute little outfit here and I'll have to show that later when I do karaoke and I also made it like I um, did this hat yeah a lot went into this hat but I want it to be kind of perfect and plus they're really kind of hard to find on the internet like um, so I just and they all looked handmade the ones that you could get that were really nice looking so I was like I might as well do my own um, hat. That's quite easy. I wish I would have gotten a bigger feather, but uh, like a huge feather would look pretty cool. And yeah, so I'm gonna wear that with um, this uh, outfit that you can't see at this moment. Um, so I'm gonna use this new palette I got. This palette is um, it's kind of hardcore because it's that same company, the Revolution Makeup. And it's tropical palette, the Tammy X. This one is just called CB01 Shadow Palette, and it's like all these dark colors. You can see like there's so many shades, like 50 shades of gray and black and all this. Um, one side's shimmery and one side's like matte. So if you want to get those kind of like shimmery, so 
I'm just going to do a palette reveal right now because I needed to switch it up. And since I'm using so much black and white, I need um, just to get a whole palette of black and white. And then I was needing to get brushes for um, this video that I'm doing, tutorial. And I picked up these um, rainbow brushes. So it's kind of interesting. Like I'm using like rainbow brush with this like black and white. Okay, so there's the palette. And then inside. Or like the colors. It does have a smell, but it's like not a bad smell, but it just smells like black and white. Oh, okay, so if I can get a good look on there. I don't know if you can see the difference between like the powdered and the shimmer. But these are like blacks, grays, all black and gray. It's like an emo palette. I'm gonna try that out. I don't even think they named, they didn't even name them because they were just so, it's hard to name everything on this palette. So be, they just give it a number. So if I ever needed to reference what color it is, they do like that number thing on the back. Okay, so I'm just gonna get started, I guess, um, on the eyes. do my base like his eye to start just like that um, black circle and just use my eyebrow to make that spot and spot I'm gonna use my spirit um, Crayola yeah when it comes back in town I'm gonna definitely pick up like a lot of these tubes because this one's like dying The wick's like coming out. Sometimes that happens when it falls out, you just really tap it out and oh, but it's getting so low, I need to pick up. <laughs> Alright, let's do this black dot. Got my mirror here. Okay, so it just goes all the way up to the eyebrow and down. Okay, he's been doing his makeup for years, but it, his look is like um, like the wet, messy look. Like how Britney Spears kind of has like a wet, messy like Christina Aguilera. Like, they're all kind of like um, Alice Cooper. Even him himself, like he said about Lady Gaga, like she's doing what he he was doing, like with the whole shock rock thing. Because apparently he said, oh, the shock rock. The audience has been shocked so much that shock rock is dead. So like some artists, like Gaga and stuff, are still trying to like do that like how he did. My sketch I did, that one was, um, had everything on it, so I wanted to do like the squiggles. So let me find a squiggly one. He does these squiggles. This is kind of his basic one. He does like, um, the circles with like the eyes. And like, I just want to do like a stick through it, but he doesn't just do that. 
And then on this channel, it's all about combining the looks because it's the best way. Yeah, that was his brand too. Like he always on his brand had like the eyes. That's how people knew it was him. And he's always been into the eye makeup because he had his own mascara, remember? His like mascara company. He should have kept up, kept up with his makeup. He could have been like, done wonders. So it's like that spider album. But here, on his paranormal one. It's like spider-esque. This one like big. That's what I'm working with now, so I'm just gonna get into it. Just do it. I'm gonna use this palette now because I want to make this black part blendable more so. I'm gonna try my new unicorn brush. Okay, black. Can I move my little mirror? But his makeup's never perfect. It's like you can always see his skin like sweating through it or peering through it, and I think that's like his look. It's like the messy, but um, like the you just came from the rain, like out from the rain with your heavy black makeup. Those ones, like his main ones here. I like these two kind of straight. And like maybe the rest are less legs squiggly. Yeah, today's a rainy day here. Um, so it's like if I did my makeup, I should just go out in the rain before my karaoke and get like um, all messy like he does. Oh yeah, he does those little lines here on his face. That's one of his signatures. He doesn't always do it because I notice sometimes he leaves it blank. Like here he did it, obvious. Like to... And then... Let's see. Yeah, he always shaves. He never grows his beard. Like, he had a beard kind of, I think, like once he grew his beard a bit. But he always shaves. Yeah, so here he, he didn't have it that day. Just his eye makeup. So he doesn't always wear those lines. But I want to because that's one of his his signature. Even on this album cover, he didn't wear his lines. Because he's messy. He would, like, if he... I feel like the sun nights he wouldn't, he would do it so greasy, like, maybe I'll just do it, like, what would Alice do? Like, <sighs> yeah, there was the origins of the band name, Alice. Like, someone said it came out of a... Ouija board, like they were doing some Ouija board, like um, seance thing, and then the name that came out to who they were talking to was like Alice Cooper, and then that's what they named the band after. So I heard that story. I don't know how, how true it is, but if anyone that knows the true story, I don't know. In the comments, just leave it because I don't know that part about the band name, but that's the one I heard, and I like, oh, I like that. Oh, so I was like, that's how the name came out. I always thought it was supposed to be like Alice, like through the looking glass sort of deal. And then speaking of like kind of spooky stuff, like Ouija boards and things, uh, he also was in a haunted house. Oh, I say also because King Diamond had like a haunted house. And then um, apparently Alice Cooper was in the An Amityville Horror House. And like they didn't tell him until after, and they said stuff was like moving in the basement. So I was like, oh my god, these like rockers come in contact with these like haunted entities and houses and stuff. It's kind of crazy. 
But he was see like he really believed it. Maybe I'll put some mascara on just to kind of boost my eyes. Like his mascara, but I got this instead. I don't, I don't even think you could find his mascara. It's probably really stale, but I got this. Uh, also another revolution. I don't know. I'm falling in love with that um, company. <laughs> um, it's called Tasty Peach um, Mascara, and it actually smells good. It smells kind of like a, it's. Or it smells some pretty bad like mascara, but this one smells really good. It's like. I'm going to put this on. I probably should have curled my eyes. It's not too late. I don't know, how do you do it? Because some people put it on before they do the mascara, and some people put to curl it after, but when you curl it after, it makes this thing get dirty. But you're supposed to use it before. Um, some people use it like both ways, but I'm gonna use it when it's wet. I'll just wash it later. Can't really tell, but <laughs> they're almost done. Basically, he doesn't do too crazy. Like... It's gonna make it look a bit more dirty, I guess. Like smudge it, smudge it, or maybe I'll use um, more of this palette. This is black, black, and oh yeah, I noticed too. Like in his older years, I remember when he was like a young teenager, or when he was like, he would always, he was so skinny. Like he would then put like um, low lights on his cheekbones. So maybe I wanna do like, I'm gonna try one of these grays out on my uh, cheekbone to make it like corpse paint a little bit. So let me try this one to start. Maybe use like that one. Some low lights, okay that's cool. Like, it looks corpsey, I never really used them before. Yeah, I think I'm like falling in love with low lights now. A little bit like tons. I'm kind of using all of them. Because they're kind of like a just kind of stroking it down. <laughs> Mix all the colors until you get the one that you desire. I'm gonna do what Marilyn Manson does. She puts the black. <laughs> I'm just using liquid liner. Cause it looks like that's what he uses all the time because it looks kind of like flaky sometimes. Like a crack doll. Like China doll look. Flaky. Mm -hmm. Because he gets them so pin straight perfect. 
kind of the shading this looks like it's like actually cut <sighs> okay that's good enough I think like he probably spends hours making it perfect but this is already like a half an hour video so I'm gonna have to edit it a lot I think I'm done, so I'm gonna get to my outfit. So when you come back, you're gonna see Alice Cooper, okay? All right, see you soon. We're spinning around on this ball of hay. There's no parole, there's no great escape. We're sentenced here until the end of days. And then my brother, there's a price to pay. We're only human, we were born to die. Without the benefit of reason why. We live for pleasure to be satisfied. And now it's over, there's no place to hide. Why don't you come down to you? It's such a brutal planet, it's such an ugly world. Why don't you come down to you? This world is such perfection, it's just like paradise. A true grand creation. From Yeah, we're gonna fight, we do it every night Baby, when we scratch, you know I'm gonna bite You can make me die, I can make you cry I'll be sick to try, that's the reason why No one else can make me feel like I do, I do No one ever gets as deep as I do inside you, baby Love hurts good on a bed of nails I'll lay you down there all else fails I'll drive you like a hammer on a bed of nails Yeah, first we're gonna kiss Then we're gonna say Dirty little words only lovers say Rocking through the night Rolling on the floor When they hear us screaming They'll be banging down the door No one else can make me feel like I do I do No one else can It's as deep as I do Inside you, baby Our love is a bed of nails Love hurts good on a bed of nails I lay you down when all else fails I drive you like a hammer on the bed of nails Nails, bed of nails I drive you like a hammer on the bed of nails Ah, ah, oh, oh. I drive you like a hammer on the bed of nails Your cruel device, your blood like ice. One look could kill 
my pain, your thrill. I want to love you, but I better not touch. I want to hold you, but my senses tell me that's not my one. I don't wanna break these 